Okay, so we learned that there's three kinds of water in the Chesapeake Bay. We've got salt water from the Atlantic Ocean, fresh water from the rivers flowing into the bay, and then we've also got that mixture of the salt and the fresh water called brackish water. And it's really cool when these mix. And so I've got a tool here that's gonna help me show you what that looks like. So I've got this tank and it's clear in the front and there's a divider right here. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour water on both sides. One is salt water, which would be from the Atlantic Ocean and one is fresh water, which would be that water coming in from the rivers. And we're gonna see what happens when they mix. So I'm gonna open up both bottles here. I'm gonna try not to spill it all over myself. And I'm gonna pour the water in. And you can see those two colors, if you look closely, you might be able to see what's starting to happen on the inside. Okay, now my jars are empty and I'm gonna take the divider out and let's see what happens to our water. Can you see all of that swirling? And can you see that it's starting to turn green? Well, what that is, is on the bottom, that is our salt water, ocean water. The reason it goes to the bottom is it's, it's more dense. It, got, it has more stuff in it. It's got all that salt and minerals. And then our fresh water doesn't have as much of that in it, so it goes on the top. And then that green layer in the middle, that is the brackish water. Those are those two kinds of water that are starting to mix together. And this is the water that we have in the Chesapeake Bay. Some animals really like that fresh water. Some like the salty water and some kind of like it in the middle. So it's important when we're learning about the bay to understand how this water is mixing and what parts of the bay we're gonna see these kinds of water because then we can guess what kind of plants and animals are gonna be there. I hope you enjoyed our mini lesson on the Chesapeake Bay. After this video, there's some other links for activities to check out and some crafts to do. Um, if you'd like to learn more about different topics, check out our virtual classroom at sultanaclassroom.org. Thank you so much and have a good one.